Today, Pakistan is facing an existential challenge from India, but we will stand with Kashmiris come what may. This was stated by the Chairman Parliamentary Committee on Kashmir, Sayyid Fakhar Imam, who was the chief guest at the seminar arranged by the Institute of Strategic Studies, Islamabad, in order to express solidarity with the people of Kashmir. Federal Minister for Kashmir Affairs and Gilgit Baltistan, Ali Amin Gandapur, reiterated the government of Pakistan's resolve to highlight the Kashmir issue at every forum and mentioned that if India undertakes any aggression, then the entire Pakistan, comprising of 220 million people, shall confront it. Earlier, Ambassador Azazah Machaudhry, DG ISSI, introduced the topic and welcomed the guests. Keynote speakers included former Foreign Secretary Jalil Abbas Jalani and Chairperson Stasi University, Dr. Maria Sultan, who gave an in-depth talk on Pakistan's stance on Kashmir. Chairman Board of Directors, ISSI, Ambassador Khalid Mahmood, also summed up the proceedings. The Pakistani nation is standing with the people of Kashmir all the way. And therefore, in this time of trial and tribulation for the people of Kashmir, it is even more important that we stand with them and give them the hope that this struggle against injustice that they have been braving all these years, especially the latest recklessness by Modi administration, they will, inshallah, the Kashmiris will, inshallah, prevail and Pakistan will be standing with them. The message from Islamabad is very simple. One, this is illegal. Number two, this is the making of an international crime against humanity. And number three, uh, no act of belligerence, whether on the people of Kashmir or against Pakistan, will stand unresponded. If they want to come and try their luck, 26th and 27th of February should not be a far short from what is actually done on ground. We will fight the next 100 battles if we have to over Kashmir. But let me state this very clearly, that Kashmir is part of Pakistan, and this is the message which we want to give. I uh, have very strong reason to believe, having dealt with Kashmir for a very long time during my diplomatic career, having served in India as High Commissioner and also as Deputy High Commissioner, I have absolutely uh, no doubt that Kashmiris have never accepted the Indian rule despite all the, uh, uh, the suppression or the oppression that they faced at the hands of India. They will not be cowed down by the 5th of August.